What's up guys? So this is day three of the 100 push-up challenge for 30 days. Um, got back from work, did my laundry, showered, ate. Now I'm just gonna do these push-ups. And honestly, I was so tired today, I'm probably gonna take a nap right after. And then, and then probably get to my other errands after. You're asking me, oh, okay, why are you doing 100 push-ups after your bath? I can do whatever I want. And honestly, I just like to just kind of shower right away after I come back from work. So don't mind the bonnet because I'm going to go to take a nap after this. So listen, bro, I got to protect the hair. If you guys didn't know, pillows absorb moisture from your hair. So get yourself a bonnet, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to start it out. I'm not going to do 50 like I normally do. To be honest, today I'm kind of tired. Normally I'll bang out the first 50. And then do like 10 sets of like five reps. But today I'm just going to take it easy. And I think I'm just going to do like four sets of 25. Nothing crazy. Just because honestly, my shoulders are kind of starting to like hurt, man. Like I'm starting to feel it. And I'm and I'm thinking it's because of that first 50 reps I do. I feel like you can't just do that every day. I don't know. I'm starting to feel it and I'd work. So I get to decide how much reps I do for this. Not you. Anyways, let me get to it. So that was 25. <sighs> yeah. Not as bad as normal. But eventually I feel like I should get used to this. Um, I'm thinking eventually I'll be able to do more than 50 in one go. But I feel like it's good to just take days where I change up the sets a little bit. Because the last thing I want to do is jack up my shoulders. I remember when I was like 15, I did like like in a ridiculous amount of push-ups in, in a week. My goal was like something like 10,000. And I was in my bedroom for like hours just doing push-ups. And then I ended up actually like injuring myself. And I really think that injury has kind of lasted like my whole life almost as in like benching if i'm to get re-injured anywhere it's gonna be that same shoulder that i messed up when i was younger but i can still like do everything and there's no issues or anything but i feel like that just did like some like real life long damage because shoulders just have so many muscles in it right let me get the, the next 25 here i should be able to Okay, yeah, 12. <laughs> yeah, so I was definitely right. My shoulders are hurting a little bit. I did 12 that one, I was trying to just do 25. I guess it's gonna be a little bit longer than I uh, expected. But um, yeah, these 100 push-ups every day, they, they actually aren't a joke, like they're, they're serious business, I guess. And I mean, I had work as well. Like, I had work. Like, I woke up 4 a.m. Like, like 6:30 to 
2.30. And then I had like errands to do. Honestly, I'm making up excuses. I don't know. My body's just not 100%. And it is what it is. We're just doing the best we can. Another 12, maybe. So 13, 12, 25. Now we're at 50. <sighs> yeah, it's not too bad. Hopefully after I get some sleep, probably need to stretch more. Maybe do some like cable pulls or something for my shoulders. Maybe use a band. I feel like that might help because I'm not trying to injure my shoulders. It's only like on day three. Okay, 50 more. 50 more. See, now I guess this is the, the consistency part, you know? I'm making myself do this every day. I'll do them in my PJs, man. I don't care. Getting this out of the way so that I can do other stuff. Okay. That was 12, so 62. <sighs> Again, don't mind the bandit, okay? The bonnet, I mean. <sighs> any any man can wear a printed bonnet and it's okay. We live, we're in 2024, guys. You can wear bonnets. Ah, 12, oof. I started reading more lately. I'm reading up this book on like, it's on like trading and stuff, just so I can kind of understand it a little bit more. But it's like one of those reads where like you probably get like a chapter at a time. You're not like super like invested. It's not like it's a novel or anything like that, but I mean, it's interesting, so. I used to read a lot when I was younger. So 12. So about 62. Probably do like 13. Let's wrap this up. So. I am either at 75 total or I'm at 63. I made the, made the mistake. I, do, I don't know where I'm at. I was either at 50 before and I did 13 or I was at 62 and I did 13 and I'm at 75. Now, I'm not going back on the footage so I'm just going to have to suffer and just do 12 and be sure about it. You know what I mean? So you got to gotta focus. Do my 12 and I'll get 75 for sure. One, two, three, four. So for sure now I'm at 75. When I do watch over this footage, and I, if I find out I'm actually over, man, it is what it is. So 75, about 25 more. Let's see if me and this uh, bonnet can just finish it, you know what I'm saying? Finish this so I can see if I can get 25. Just one goal, we're gonna give it a shot. I'm not gonna hold my breath. Let's go, let's go. Let's see if I can just get this 25 right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
All right. That's okay. Whatever. That's ten. I got fifteen more. Day three. So I got like twenty-seven more days of this. After this challenge, I've got a way more fun challenge for myself for the 30 days after that. I do plan on just doing like a carnivore diet and I'm just gonna record myself and everything I eat and see how last, how long I can last just eating straight meat for a month. Pause, pause, but yeah. And then I might just do like a physique, like before and after of uh, what happens if you have 30 days of just eating straight meat. And yeah, being on the carnivore diet. So we're gonna do our last 15 here. We're gonna bang it out. Let's get it going. Uh, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, seven, That's it. That's it for today. Take a nap. Wake up. Still have some more laundry left to do. And then today I'm going to try to go to bed early. Just because I slept for like eight hours yesterday. But like, bro, I was so tired at work, man. So I'm trying not to be tired like that. So yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. And uh, yeah, peace.